Terrifying moments for several fast food employees across our area held at gunpoint and forced into a freezer. After similar cases in Wake Forest, Morrisville, Nightdale, Raleigh, and Durham, Cary police now think the same crook could be behind each robbery. CBS 17's Colleen Quigley is live tonight in Nightdale with a closer look at the crimes. Colleen. Yeah, Marius and Angela, so this is one of at least a half dozen McDonald's or Bojangles that police say an armed man, sometimes wearing a mask, stormed into early in the morning, held employees at gunpoint, and then made off with cash tonight. This fast food bandit is still out there, and police are really trying to find him. It's just before 3.30 in the morning on July 22nd. An employee at this Wake Forest McDonald's describes a terrifying ordeal. An armed man seen here in security photos forced his way inside and robbed the restaurant. Okay, is he still there? I don't know, sir. I don't know. This robbery was the first in a string of similar cases that Cary police believe are being pulled off by the same crook. Warren say he's responsible for eight armed robberies in Durham, Nightdale, Morrisville, Raleigh, and this Wake Forest Bojangles back in October. Y'all need to get some people up here. We just got robbed. In many of the cases, the thief came into the restaurant early in the morning and forced employees into a freezer. Me and the seven employee I was taking home were walking out to the car. I had the deposit in my hand. He runs out of the bushes with a loaded gun and points it at me and him. The most recent case happened earlier this month at a Cary Bojangles. Were you robbed at gunpoint? Yes, yes, ma'am. Where, according to Warren, the crook told an employee he would, quote, blow your expletive head off as she put money into a zippered bag. Are they still there now? I don't, I don't know. He put me in the freezer. I don't, I don't think so. One employee says the thief had a large tattoo on his left shoulder or bicep and is described as a black man standing 5'4 to 5'8. And as always, if you know anything about any of these robberies, you're asked to give police a call. Reporting in Nightdale, Colleen Quigley, CBS 17 News.